Should you become a real estate agent? Probably not. <laughs> okay, hi guys. This is Aina Shea, your best real estate agent in Namibia. Um, today's video is inspired by a video that I did a couple of weeks ago uh, on how to become a real estate agent in Namibia. So now I realize, or I notice that many people are now commenting and they are contacting me to find out when is the exam and blah, 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 blah. And everybody is eager to write that exam. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for taking part and actually listening to me. Uh, please, if you have not yet subscribed on my YouTube channel, please subscribe and uh, hit that bell notification so you don't miss any new videos that I make. This specific video is to guide you that wants to become a real estate agent and to probably save you time and your money to probably save you from making a mistake of becoming a real estate agent because I think people think that being a real estate agent is a very easy thing because I keep smiling and keep laughing, you know, joy and blah. I, my friend, it's very tough. <laughs> it's tough if you don't know what to do. It's only nice when you know what to do, okay? So I'm going to be sharing five things that you should look into to decide whether you will make a good agent or not. Number one, do not become a real estate agent if you are lazy. <laughs> yes. So this is for people who think that being a real estate agent is easy money. Uh, you can just get like, a house somewhere and then advertise on Facebook and people will run after you and they'll sign and then you will cash out quickly and then next week and the next week. No, this is not the kind of business where you pass your exam today and tomorrow, the next week, you're already being paid. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's not as simple as it looks. There's a lot of things that, you, that, that goes into it for you to actually earn money, right? And so that's why it's not for lazy people. You have to be hardworking. You have to be determined. You have to have a, a spirit of a, a hustler. A hustler. <laughs> A hustler. If you have never sold a suite in your life, my gosh, I don't know how you're going to sell a house. <laughs> yeah, so it's not for lazy people. So you need to be a hardworking person. You have to be a diligent person, right? Okay, number two, do not become a real estate agent if you are impatient. Mm, yeah. <laughs> if you can't wait to, to make money or if you are desperate to, to get paid, it's not your type of business because this industry, this business requires you to go through different procedures and processes before you even start earning. You know, it's, it's, it's already <laughs> a lot of work to even get a property and then sell it. Getting a property on its own, it's a lot of hard work and it's a lot of patience, you know, and you're going to be dealing with people that will test your patience also. Yeah. I've seen agents who go for months without even getting paid without even selling or even doing a single rental, you know? Yeah, that's why I don't want you to get into things that you know you cannot handle. Number three, do not become a real estate agent if you are not teachable, right? So this is not the kind of business where you just go in and you say, no, I have a few connections there. Everybody's my friend. I have the best smile in the world. <laughs> I'm pretty. Uh, I can talk to people. Uh, what, what, what? I can sell. I've sold cars. What, what? This is totally different. <laughs> it's totally different. It's tough. But guys, it's tough. Yeah. So it's, 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 it's the type of business where you need training. You have to go through training. You have to read a lot. You need to understand the market. You need to understand the systems. Uh, you need to understand the people, you know, your market, your niche, right? So it's, 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 it's not that kind of business where you go in and you think you know it all. You have to learn. You will need to learn from people. So you avoid making a lot of mistakes. Uh -huh. Okay. So number four, do not become a real estate agent if you are a quitter, a person who gives up easily, a person who easily gets discouraged. Somebody say something bad, you're already like emotional, <laughs> catching feelings. <laughs> uh, yeah. You, you, you have a goal and you can't even see to it that it's, it's through without giving up. You start something, you don't finish it. You're a quitter. So you cannot be a successful real estate agent. So don't try, don't even bother. 
because you're going to fall on your face so many times. <laughs> you, you're going to need to encourage yourself all the time, you know. Don't get easily discouraged and you want to quit. You want to resign. You, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> yeah. it's, not, it's not, it's not a, a, a business for the weak. You need to have a thick skin, right? You have to have a strong emotional stamina, a strong emotional toughness. So being a real estate agent is a tough job. You have to be tough to do it successfully or else you will fail. So don't even try it. Number five, do not become a real estate agent if you are not driven. This is a type of business where you are actually your own boss. The business is your own. You are the boss. So it's not the type of business where you have someone telling you, uh, wake up, it's time to go to work. Uh, did you call the client? Uh -uh. Oh, did you advertise? Uh -uh. You're just lazy, watching Netflix, watching whatever. I don't know. <laughs> yeah? This is the time you are your own boss, my friend. You do everything yourself. And if you don't do it, you, you, have, you must have a certain, a certain self-discipline. <laughs> yeah, you have to, to, to push yourself to accomplish things without anyone telling you what to do. If you can't do this, don't even try because you're going to fail. You will fail and we will laugh at you. <laughs> so, please... Guys, get serious. This is a serious thing. This is a serious thing. We love. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. So don't even try. If, if you can't wake up on time, you, have, you don't have a certain time you wake up. If, you, if, if all you do is watch Netflix, you wake up at 11 or 12 in a day while people are working or snoring, <laughs> you won't make it. You will not survive. It's rough out there it's very tough you have a you have to have a mentality of a hustler or of a business owner like you own the business yourself right this is not the type of business where you just wake up anyhow anytime you feel you watch movies anytime series and throughout the day you, you will you will not survive this will step on you like a mosquito my friend <laughs> trying to survive trying you know, today is a good deal. Tomorrow is inconsistency. A lot of inconsistency in the industry. So if you are that type of person, lazy, impatient, not teachable, quitter, not even driven, I don't think you will survive. It. You will not even survive a year. You will not actually, you will not survive three months because it's tough out there. So what are you going to eat if you don't sell in three months? Hmm? If you should become a real estate agent, you should be a very hardworking person. And then you should be very patient. And then you have to be teachable. Learn from people that know what they are doing and learn from them. Read, read books on real estate. Understand, understand the investors, understand the developers, understand the banks, understand the lawyers, understand everything concerning real estate. Understand the game, understand the industry, understand repo rates. Know the game, know the language. Don't give up too easy. Make sure you have a goal and you make sure you succeed in that goal. Don't give up. If something is not working, it doesn't mean that it, it will not work tomorrow. So keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing. Being persistent, being consistent until you get through. That's being a real estate agent. Eventually, the dollars will come. Eventually, when you are persistent, when you persevere, eventually the dollars come, right? <laughs> okay? Being driven, self-motivated. Read, be around people who are speaking positive, huh? who have hope. Not, ah, the economy is bad. You no, know, there's no money in the country. How, what are we going to eat? Uh, people are stealing the money, fish rot, what, what? <laughs> it will continue. <laughs> They, it will continue as long as you're around such, as long as you listen to that. Make up your own economy. Come on, work hard. Read, feed on the positive materials. If I've insulted you, I'm sorry, but it's because I care. Yeah, so please don't catch feelings. I care for you. That's why I'm teaching all this. That's why I'm sharing all this. It's because I care for you. Please make the right decision. Just be honest to yourself. If you know 
you are not up to it, don't do it. You lose a lot of money, you waste your time, you will face a lot of emotional damage because we'll step on you as the veteran agents. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> you don't try it. Rather look for a traditional type of career that you go to your work at uh, eight o'clock and you knock off at five. I think you'll be more at peace. So thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm going to be sharing a lot of content on real estate in Namibia and I'm going to be helping a lot of people. And this is really for free. People should be paying me, but I'm giving this for free. <laughs> subscribe, share with your family, share with your unemployed friends, share. <laughs> and see you again next time.